Hyundai Motor Company has officially unveiled the 2024 Santa Fe in the global market. The manufacturer has revamped the design language of the SUV radically for the fifth generation of the SUV. Hyundai Santa Fe will be offered with multiple engine options in the global market. It measures 4,830mm in length, 1,900mm in width and 1,730mm in height. It has a wheelbase of 2,815mm. The biggest change in the 2024 Santa Fe is the new design. It is boxy, bold and demands attention on the road. Hyundai is using edge-shaped lighting elements. The bonnet is now placed higher and the headlamps have an edge shape. On the side, there are 21-inch alloy wheels, large fenders with pronounced wheel arches and a lot of glass area. At the rear, the tailgate is now quite wide with horizontally stacked LED tail lamps that also form an edge. Depending on the market, the Santa Fe will be offered in 10 or 11 color shades. Santa Fe's all-new interior contrasts with the exterior by emphasizing horizontal and vertical design elements and matching the tone and mood of the exterior. An edge-shaped design is applied to the dashboard and air vents to enhance the sense of openness and create a unique design balance. The new interior comes with useful convenience features such as UVC sterilization tray and dual wireless charging system for smartphones to create sophisticated user experience with SUV-like practicality. Santa Fe's first-in-class panoramic curve display, which encompasses the 12.3-inch digital cluster and infotainment system, enhances driver visibility and creates a sense of luxury. The all-new Santa Fe offers class-leading interior space. Fully foldable second and third row seats create a terrace-like space at the rear with a wider tailgate open, enabling users to enjoy the outdoors effortlessly. The all-new Santa Fe is available in five interior colors including obsidian black, supersonic grey, pecan brown, forest green and black. The North American spec Santa Fe will offer two powertrain options, a 2.5-litre turbocharged four-cylinder producing 277 horsepower and 311 pound-feet of torque and a 1.6-litre turbocharged hybrid powertrain. The 1.6-litre gas engine puts on 177 horsepower and 195 pound-feet on its own. The 2.5-litre turbo is familiar to us from the Santa Cruz pickup and it gets the same 8-speed dual-clutch transmission here, while hybrid models use 6-speed automatic. The all-new Santa Fe is scheduled to release in Korea in the second half of this year and in North America or Europe in the first half of the next year.